They're creepy and they're kooky, mysterious and spooky. They're all together hooky, the Adams family. Their house is a museum, when people come to see them, they really are a scream, the Adams family. When you're an Adams, you need to have a little moonlight. When you're an Adams, you need to feel a little chill. You have to see the world in shades of grey You have to put some poison in your day That's the way when, when you're, you're an Adams, Adams You need to have a sense of humour ha, when, when you're, you're an Adams, Adams You need to have a taste for death ah. Who cares about the world outside and what it wants from you when you're an Adams, you do what Adams always do. In the Adams family, I play Gomez. I play Morticia Adams. I play Wednesday Adams. Um, I'm the daughter of Morticia and Gomez, and I have a little brother named Pugsley. Why? At least once a day! Hi, my name is Laura Russo, and I am the director of Adams Family. I felt that the Adams Family was a really good fit for the students that we have, especially those who are graduating this year. When I was reading the script, I saw several actors playing each of the roles, and so that really indicated to me that we definitely have the talent to do this show this year. Wait till things get hot. When you're an Adams, you have to really stir the hot. So give us shadows and give us gloom. Broken glass in a motel room. Something fun we can all exhume and give it all tonight. And on this night, we summon our beloved ancestors. Why do we do this? Because living or dead, family is still family. Yeah! I would say Gomez, well, he's the father of the family, so he loves his wife, Morticia, a lot. Um, and he really is, in the show, he's torn between um, pleasing his wife, Morticia, and his daughter, Wednesday, because they both want really different things, and the whole show sort of, like, centers around him and his relationship with the two. Morticia is the matriarch of the family, and she's very bossy, and she likes things to go her way. So in the show, when things start to unravel, she becomes very dramatic and upset. I would say to um, the parents and grandparents that they're going to see uh, all the characters that they loved uh, seeing on the TV show when they were growing up, but also the younger audience will appreciate the um, contemporary music within and, um, and also the contemporary twist on the story. The favorite part of working on that is just seeing how the music that I'm playing and the playing comes together with the Funny dancers off. and the actors and singing and how it all comes into one big performance. It's really spectacular. basically just one big family and all of our traditions that we have towards the end of the show and during the shows and stuff is, is really fun, it's really special. Rigor Mortis! I think my favorite part about doing the Chatham High School shows is um, Sort of just like the big family that all the theater kids um, have together. Like we go to parties together, we go to dinner together. It's just sort of a nice community. Apartment.